Hey there everyone, Barbling here along with Mo, the amazing mowing piggy moose. Can you actually see him or are you just seeing the beak of doom here? Hang on, let's fix this. Alrighty, that's better. We have Mo, the amazing mowing piggy moose and the beak of doom, here we go. Right, today's self-confidence challenge. Today's self-confidence challenge is a topic near and dear to my heart. And it's this, I have doubts, but that's okay. Now, why is that so important? Because sometimes, you know, you'll see people online and you'll see the highlight reels that they show on Facebook and everything that they talk about, that life is joyous, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. And you look at them and you say to yourself, wow, why is everything so great for them? Why don't, why does everything work so perfectly? Uh, but yet every time I try something, I'm besieged by doubts. And when I think that I can't do it, when I think, hey bird, we want you up here. Want to come up here? Woo! Follow the leaf. You can do it. Come on. There you go. Anywho's, <laughs> sometimes when doubts show up, you know, it stops you, it stifles you. You build up in your mind. I'm not 100% sure this is going to work, so hey, why don't I protect myself and I'm just not gonna do anything whatsoever. And you know something, I can totally relate to that, I can totally empathize with that. That used to be the story of my life, um, yeah. But the thing is, is that it's okay to have doubts because what is the worst thing that could possibly happen <laughs> Sorry, Mo. What is the worst thing that could possibly happen uh, if things don't go the way you want? Well, you learn what doesn't work and you use that knowledge to springboard ahead to ideally something in the future that, yeah, could probably work better. So that is today's self-confidence challenge. And let me just bring this down over here so I can read. This week, what have we covered? We have covered five things, and they are as follows. One, I'm above ground. Woohoo! Two, I have today to grow. Three, I have tomorrow to anticipate. It really looks like I am looking over in that direction. I'm gonna have to check this video when I'm done. Four, I have fears, and that's okay. That was yesterday, and today, I have doubts, and that is okay. So, that is basically covers our first week of the self-confidence challenge. And if you might remember earlier today, I did a video where I basically looked like heck because I had some issues this time with my right leg and such. And I explained how you lose your fear to do video, uh, Facebook Lives. The thing is, is that even when you're feeling like heck, if you're still able to teach, people aren't going to care what you look like, all right? Uh, people will get worried about how you're feeling. As a matter of fact, I got several PMs from that last video I did. Here, do you want this one? Piggy mooses. But as you, could, as you can see now, uh, several hours later, here I am, back vaguely more alive and giving today's class. So what is your takeaway from all of this? If you have doubts about moving forward, that's okay. Honor those doubts. Ask yourself, all right, what exactly is this doubt trying to teach me? And then give yourself permission to say, all right, I'm not 100% sure that's going to work, but hey, uh, if I do nothing, I'm just going to end up staying in one place, and that would be extraordinarily sad. So, yes, this is Barbling here with Mo, the amazing mowing piggy moose, and his romaine of wonders. And, oh, yes, one other thing. Uh, Dennis Becker and I, we are doing group coaching that not only includes mindset, motivation, and self-confidence, but also some really fantastic internet marketing uh, techniques, abilities, uh, tricks and tips as well. You can learn all about that at Ask TTP, HTTP, Barb Talk Take Two, 
uh, colon slash slash ask com plural forward slash scdab otherwise known as ask com forward slash plural you can tell it's been a great day today sc dab Mickey Mouse stabbing. Anywho, this is Barb Ling signing off, and we will see you. Swing! Oof. On the inside. Right, Mo? Yes, I know. You're such a good little moosey. Take care, everybody. <laughs> Bye-bye. <laughs>